question is asking, what is the percentage composition of oxygen in this glucose? To answer this, we're first going to calculate the mass of our glucose, and then we'll calculate the mass of the oxygen. And then finally, we'll compare these two masses together to find the ratio as a percent. Okay, so to be able to calculate the mass of our glucose, we need to calculate the mass of each of our elements for this particular compound. Okay, and then we'll add them all together. So we know we've got some carbon right here, and we have six carbons, and carbon has a atomic mass of 12, so 6 times 12. Our hydrogen has an atomic mass of 1, and we have 12 hydrogen, so we would add to our carbon total 12 times 1 to get our hydrogen total. Our oxygen has an atomic mass of 16, and we have 6 oxygen, so we will add that on to get a total of 180 atomic mass units for our whole compound. Okay, so now let's calculate the mass of our oxygen. And the mass of our oxygen, of course, is just 6 times 16, because we have 6 oxygen, and each one weighs 16, giving us a total of 96 atomic mass units. So now to get our percentage, we need to calculate and compare this mass of our oxygen to the mass of our whole glucose, and then, of course, multiply that by 100%, so that it's written as a percentage. So 96 divided by 180 is equal to 0 0.533. When you multiply that by 100, you get 53.3%. So our oxygen accounts for more than half, more than 50% of the weight of our entire compound.